Russia deploys its submarines on the coasts of Europe and the US. Over the past several years, Moscow has been producing a series of submarines that have the capability to reach the most critical targets in the US or continental Europe, and now NATO members are increasingly sounding the alarm over the activities of Vladimir Putin's submarine fleet. It was stated by Newsweek outlet. It is said that the Russian Navy commands one of the most diverse submarine fleets in the world. Some are capable of carrying ballistic missiles with nuclear warheads, which Moscow considers key to its strategic deterrent. Experts also say that, in the unlikely case of war, Russia's fleet will be used as one of the tools in the country's escalation management toolkit. In other words, the threat from Moscow's submarines armed with conventional weapons will allow it to deter Western adversaries from bringing their advantages in other areas into play. There are growing fears among NATO members that Putin could use his fleet to target underwater cables and critical infrastructure that are vital to global communication systems. Undersea cables, especially undersea fiber optic cables, are critical pieces of fixed infrastructure that are extremely difficult to defend. Putin has repeatedly accused NATO of directly participating in his full-scale invasion of Ukraine, which he launched on February the 24th, 2022. With those threats come renewed fears that the military alliance could be dragged into the conflict. According to Michael Peterson, director of Russia Maritime Studies Institute, any improbable but potential war by Russia against NATO is likely to focus in on ground warfare. Russia's current submarine activity is as dangerous as Cold War levels in terms of sheer volume. We have indications that nuclear-powered submarines have been deploying off the coast of the United States and into the Mediterranean and elsewhere along European periphery in ways that mirror Soviet-style submarine deployments in the Cold War, he said.